Howdy, y'all. Okay. I'm gonna give you a military industrial complex problem. One last shred of my fucking time and consideration. Okay. You guys could help? Yeah, you bear with me. I, I already put this out there. So some of you already heard it. <coughs> we're, we're, we're Monday, July, uh, August, uh, whatever the Monday is, 7th, 8th, 8th, no, yeah, something like that. <coughs> Who gives a shit? So, um, everyone's liable for their fucking products. They kill you. Well, you know. If it's a defective product, the manufacturer gets sued and held accountable and has to recall and all that shit. Uh, you know, before it got sued for the Pinto, I had to put the repair out. And a zillion ma examples of manufacturers being held accountable, which of course you fucking are. Despite what that fucking uh, pathetic piece of shit George Bush did to the... Agenda 21 soft kill, uh, what do you call it, the uh, big pharma complex, and somehow magically annul their liability. You no, know, they're like they're they're like sacred children with no responsibility whatsoever. That you put deadly weapons into their hands, you're pretty fucked. You deserve your own extinction. That said, I promise you I will give this one more little bit of my time. You didn't like the first peace plan. You didn't like the second. You didn't like making people put sureties on their products, whether it's a atomic Agenda 21 water cooker or, or a Bhopal chemical plant or a train load of pipe wash, oil pipe wash or what, whatever the fuck. Okay, so here's what you do. <clears throat> because you've given up this magical product liability to the military industrial complex protection racket for whatever fucking reason, whether you're on the take and you're, you're actually... Uh, the, the corporation that owns you is doing contracting with them or whatever and they give you a few crumbs off their cock or whatever. Uh, here's what you do. You impose just like a luxury tax. You impose a military industrial complex tax or mass murderer tax, mass murderer tax, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Needless mass murderer tax, uh, mortality tax, okay? 100% on all the profits. And you close all them fucking loopholes, there's no more fucking offshoring and all that. And you hold them as accountable as you would hold Ford or Toyota or whatever. The guy that made them black holes <clears throat> that led to all the bank robberies. You know, the Acme black hole that used to get in like a pizza box. <laughs> you'd throw it on the wall and you'd walk through the, the vault wall like on Bugs Bunny was advertising there. Okay, They got held accountable. Okay, so you put this 100% tax on all the profits of the military industrial complex, which was basically supposed to be <coughs> there to serve governments and only governments. And now they'll sell to any fucking merc or arms dealer or whatever. You know, US, uh, China, Russia, Britain. France, India, fuck, they're all in it. Even Canada's got blood on its hands these days. 100% tax on all the profits and none of this fucking playing around. Well, no, that's not really profit. That's that's money I abscond or what. None of that horse shit. You, you, you got to close that all up anyhow because your whole middle manning stock exchange, it's, it's ruined you so it's put you in bankrupt, it's dissolved all your corporations and, and murdered them and freed them, freed you of them and now you're left stranded with no resources and, and, <clears throat> and a planet you've killed. So, 
tax on all military industrial complex products that are lethal. Okay. Stingers. Anything. That's like a little man portable bazooka that can shoot a plane out of the air at 5,000 feet up. Okay. Whatever. <clears throat> Anything over a personal protection level of kill. Uh, whether it's that landmine. They all got fucking electronics in it now and they have for a long time. Whether it's that artillery fucking shell, uh, that drone, that uh, projectile from space, whatever. <clears throat> Every month, once a moon or whatever, the manufacturer has to reauthorize its license. Otherwise it shuts off and that's it. Okay, so if you're fucking up, whoever owns that, it, it can not only tell where it is, but the manufacturer also has to renew the license to keep that electronic shit working, that F-16, that whatever. So if you fucked up, and another country can go and petition, or, or anyone, your neighbor, one of your citizens can go and petition and say, here's my fucking evidence, okay? Subpoena all the information. I want to know which weapons were used to fucking blow that 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 Boeing 777 one world airliner out of the sky or whatever the fuck that hospital that school Okay, we know who did it. We know who had possession of it last We know where it was before it was here because it's checked every time the satellite flies over it verifies where all these deadly ma weapons of mass destruction are and if it doesn't get renewed, just like them computer programs you buy, if the, you don't pay up, the manufacturer doesn't renew it, it shuts off. Like your cell phone, you name it. Okay, there's no reason why that isn't into all this fucking deadly shit. You know, I'm not talking your personal protection, your sidearm. You know, where somebody's got you into a corner and you weren't wise enough to get out of the corner before they trapped you there and they're, they're coming to kill you. So you gotta pull out your whatever, you know. Your 50 caliber or your 22 caliber or whatever, your your golden knitting needle on a string or whatever. Your 16 inch pipe wrench. <laughs> no, not those. That that's personal defense. That's not all we're talking about. We're talking about that armored vehicle. We're talking about that ship, that plane, that, 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 uh, radar, missile control unit that goes in that tank or that jet or, or, or that battleship or, or that missile cruiser or whatever. Hey, any, anything that can, you know, kill more than one, you know, with the exception, you know, a bullet going through three people all in one row, uh, you know. Anything bigger than that? No, 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 no. This is a weapons of mass destruction. It has to be licensed by the manufacturer and forever tracked. And um, once a month it has to have its renewal. And that's the end of all this shit, okay? There's no need to start whacking off the puppets that are put there uh, to make it look as though they're, you know, the old bombies and, 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 um, Net and Yahoo's and, and and whatever other killer you want to come up with. There's, there's no need to be bombing them. There's no need to having a whole fleet of fucking stealth bombers to go in and take out that 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 uh, Osama bin Laden uh, lackey or none of it. All you have to say is, here's your disincentive. To try and play the obsolescence game and sell us this huge fucking massive expensive trillion dollar weapon system. And then next, as soon as you're done there, you go and you sell it to the adversary. So you can come back and sell us the new shit. No, you, you just lost incentive for that because you're making a profit. It's getting taxed 100%. And that goes and is held in trust by the licensing of that, that weapon. And, and when somebody gets killed... And if the killer and, 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 and the, the owner of that weapon and, and the, the train killer, if they all get wiped out too, there's still this fund to go and compensate and, and fill in that, that hole 
where that depleted nuclear, that depleted uranium shell hit. That used to be a house with, uh, with whatever my, uh, my family or my business. But you, that, that was completely collateral damage, innocent. That has to be fucking compensated. Not that there's nothing about them kids in that school that was combatant. Bullshit. Okay, so assuming everyone's been blowed to bits, then there's still that compensation. That's what that 100% tax goes into. That does not go into your general revenues. That goes into compensating the victims when there's no other recourse to compensating them. Suing the perpetrator that pulled the trigger, the, the arms dealer, uh, the, the drug cartel, the uh, Stephen Harpers of the world, whatever. Okay? That negates all that and it cuts all this fucking problems 10%. And all the rest of the money you start putting into real health, real sciences, real education, uh, things like space travel. Not that we don't have ample fucking room here on Earth, but we have to learn and we have to spread out and avoid its extinction and we have to migrate out. That's how it is in nature. <clears throat> we have to be too busy doing that to fill in this void left at the end of this fucking gladiator nonsense, this self-kill, this military-industrial complex nonsense that those who have not evolved very, very, very soon and forced their environment to evolve with them are extinct. So I'm not talking to you. Go watch your football game. Go stuff your head up your ass. Go walk away. Put your fingers in the ear. Say, not my problem! You're dead. I'm not wasting a breath on you. I don't have much left. So, there you go. Thank you, Bear. Thanks, bud. Bear says that's enough. That's all the time. And I guess uh, we'll get this up, and then uh, I guess Wednesday that's it for for the channel. I don't know if Googleplex is just cutting off Google, the Google Plus, or if it's cutting all of them off, which, of course, includes Facebook, because they own that now, too, eh? Yeah, so, there you go, guys. Giving you a whole nine Monty, whoever wanted to copy shit. Well, nobody asked, so I don't know if anyone's done that or not, but, uh, and of course, conditions apply. You can't make money off it, and you, you can't dishonor the uh, intent of the work. Uh, free open use copyright. Protected. Peace on up, live well and prosper, survive and, you know, Earth's going to be wrecked. Most of the life will be wiped out, survive and carry on and um, now you've got the tools and you've got an everlasting pus stain on the memory of the Mutations. The abominations of desolation that Homo sapien is. And it's going to march right through with. If somebody has survived, well, you at least get a while to mull over it. <coughs> and show that something was good out of your species. There you go, guys. Catch you later.